their way to Red Bluff this weekend for what else? The annual roundup. And that's where we find Action News Now reporter Elizabeth Zeladone. So, Elizabeth, are you getting into the rodeo spirit? What's going on out there? Good morning. So I was here with the amazing Ruth, who if you come down to the rodeo, you should really meet, and John, and we're discussing this outrageous number. Just hear me out. 31,000 people come to the rodeo each year for the weekend of festivities, and out of those 31,000, all the hotels are booked in this area, and there are about 600 cowboys and cowgirls that are out competing all weekend long, so we have crazy number of people, and I'm here with John again, and he's going to discuss a little bit about what it's like to be the entertainment for all these people in the halftime. This is a very large rodeo, and it's quite an honor just to be selected to come and entertain the folks here. But this year, I brought a little something different. I brought my uh, South Dakota paint Mustangs. They come off the Rosebud Sioux Reservation. And then old Zorro there, he's a little bit of a horse of a different color. <laughs> He come out of Africa, and this is his debut out here in California. So he, he's going to be a big surprise for everybody. I know nobody's watching, so they won't see it until we get to the rodeo. But that's Zorro, come out of Africa. And do you mind telling us a little bit about what brings you here? We're talking 31,000 people come to Red Bluff. What do you like the most about Red Bluff? Well, Red Bluff, I've been coming here long enough that I, I have... Uh, lots of friends and, and uh, it's just like a family reunion and uh, you know if they didn't pay me I'd come anyway but don't tell them <laughs> that. Well you heard it he'd come anyways and then he got up early to be here with us he's gonna go take a nap now and we're gonna have a new guest come just for our next half hour and we'll really discuss a few more of the aspects you'll see if you come out this weekend as well as a possible treat for you right here on air. So make sure to tune in for now, live in Red Bluff, Elizabeth Salidon, Action News Now.